Bonjour. Today I will present before you some famous monuments of France. Let's start. This is the Eiffel Tower. It is made up of iron and is open for exploration from 1887 and from then it is one of the most powerful and distinctive symbols of Paris. It was made by Gustave Eiffel. This is the Tuileries Garden. It has very uncute trees like pink Mongolian trees, small maple trees, locust trees, Austria, cypress trees etc. It was opened in 1667 by Jacques Wurtz. It is one of the most popular gardens of the world. It's a place full of greenery and beautiful plants and flowers. This is Les Invalids. It is mostly made up of gold leaves. Its construction was completed by Jules Hardu and Mansart in Le Bay Bruant in 1670 and was opened for public in 1678. Les Invalids is an extensive complex of 17th century structures and courtyards in Paris designed for the care and housing of disabled veterans and as a place of worship. This is the Louvre Museum, or better known as Musée du Louvre. It is made up of cut stones by Pierre Lesquet, Louis Leva, Claude Perrot. The Louvre is the world's largest museum and houses one of the most impressive art collections in history. It is one of the city's biggest tourist attractions. Almost 10 million people visit the Louvre every year. This is the Notre Dame. It is made up of ashlar stones and stained glasses. Initiated by Maurice de Sully, Bishop of Paris. It is the most famous of the Gothic cathedrals of the Middle Ages and is distinguished for its size, antiquity and architectural interest. This is the Sacré Cour. It was made in 1914 with the help of travertine stones. Violet by Paul Abadi. Sacré Cour is located at the summit of the Montmartre Street, the highest point in the city. It is a popular landmark and the second most visited monument in Paris. Sacré Cour has maintained a perpetual adoration of the Holy Church since 1885. This is the Pantheon. It was made in 1790 entirely of stones, built by Jacques Germain Soufflot. The Pantheon was reconsecrated and resecularized several times during the 19th century, serving as a church in 1828-30 and in 1851-70. Today it is a civic building that serves as a repository for the remains of great French citizens, including Voltaire, Jean-Jacques Rousseau, Victor Hugo, Emile Zola, and Marie Curie. 